hello, Cancer. It looks like we have a new connection here that started off quite lovely, but then some third party decided to influence your decision on continuing to chat with this person. Let's dig in to see where this goes. Hello everyone, welcome in. This is a Cancer Tarot reading. It's a general reading for November 28th through December 4th. Already in December. Let's dig in to see what sort of theme we have for you guys for next week. Silver Siren, number 37. Okay. Used to a 10 to a 1. Sometimes this person, the Silver Siren, is the voice in your head or your person's head. Sometimes it's a person in your life. Okay. Not a good one either. It says, when is an enchantment not enchanting? When it is a spell you allow to consume your free will, even as it promises so much, yet delivers so little. The silver siren sings her song, a pretty poison to the soul. Her false allure tempts the mind, even whilst the heart feels that something is not quite right. Your power will, become, will come from discerning the truth and allowing her false promises no place in your heart. Okay, this is, this is about deciding if something or someone aligns with your integrity okay with your truth with your integrity this could this could be this could be a family member that doesn't agree with what you're doing thinks you should do something different that would disempower you okay, this could be a person you're in relationship with let's see what energy is going to complement dare i say the silver siren energy today. Okay. The word that wants to be written. Okay, I'm also getting the truth that wants to be told with that. Okay. Hmm. So is it time for some truth to come out? Where am I going here? Okay. Okay. Let's see what's going on for cancer next week. Should be interesting. Alrighty. Word that wants to be written, the truth that wants to be told. Hold. Okay, show me a clear split, please. Okay. Page of Wands underneath. Two of Cups. Wow. Eight of Wands. Three of Coins. Queen of Swords, Eight of Coins, Palace of Coins, Nine of Wands. Okay. Okay, I see what's going on here. Let me get a sip of tea. Okay. Brand new beginning in love with someone. Really beautiful one, too. Really beautiful one. Someone, who, I'm going to read. This side is you, Cancer. This is your person. This is the situation. Brand new beginning in love. Brand new. I move all these down. And it's almost like you met. This feels this feels new. This feels new. Okay. This doesn't feel like an ex. This feels new. Um, you met. Okay. Um, and you hit it off, could have met through work, could have met through work. I don't feel like it's an, exactly a coworker thing. It could be for some of you. I'm feeling it more like 
you came to their company that they work at because you're a vendor for something. You know what I mean? So you're involved, but not direct, right? Not day to day. Okay. Um, there is a little bit, because I'm getting that, I'm getting this Queen of Swords is this Silver Siren right here. Um, I'm getting that this person, whoever this is, it could be someone you're dating. It could be your mother. It could be a parent. It could be a sibling. It could be anybody I'm getting for someone that it's their mother. Um, is standing in the way of this connection. Okay. This person, very much, a, very much a good worker. Very, very much. Three of coins, eight of coins, nine of wands. Very much a hard worker. Absolutely. They aren't letting anything, because I feel like this is, the connection is being held up because of this. Okay. Queen of Swords, Palace of Coins. This person isn't comfortable with this connection. Okay. There's something about it. Um, and it's not about their comfort because this is not you. I'm getting this is someone in your sphere. It's on your side. It's in your sphere. Okay. Um, but it's not you. Okay. So this person... This person was quite curious about this connection. Okay. They 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 did feel the little the little bit of that soul bond. They did they did feel it when they first met you. Okay. And wondered if anything was going to happen, but it looks like you went in the other direction. Did you try to kill the palace of cups here? Kill the heart space? So whoever this is, Whoever this is has influence over you, has substantial influence over you. And I'm not getting that it's a wife. It could be an ex-wife. I'm not getting, I'm getting that this is a single cancer. Okay. Let's get into this. This is interesting. <laughs> Let's expand on the two of cups, please. King of Swords, Aquarius energy, Tree of Life, beautiful. Page of Coins, Seven of Coins, Three of Wands, King of Coins, Devil, Capricorn energy, Five of Cups. Okay. Fool. Yeah, going from fire to swords that fast. That's not good. Okay. 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 I feel like this didn't even really get to start. And the moment, let's say this, let's say this is your mother. Let's say this is your mother. The mo moment your mom caught wind that you had any interest in this person, it's like, no. No, 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 no. Stop this now. So you minimize communication with her. And the thing is, is that they were, they were really looking forward to talking with you more. They were really looking forward to talking with you more. They know that there was a fear influence with you. Okay. And they, 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 they did, even though this wasn't something where there was a lot of groundwork laid, it still made them very, very sad that you were easily controlled by fear. Cause that's, that's what she is. That's what she is. That's what her influence is. Okay. Eight of wands. Let's expand on the eight of wands. King of Wands is a coin. Yeah, you 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 were you were gung ho for this. Showing up fiery and amazing too in that Leo energy. Ace of Coins. You you were gung ho on this. You were gonna you were gonna make this real. You were looking forward to this starting. Queen of Swords. Who is this bitch, please? Page of Cups. 
Sun, Leo energy. I'm getting, for some of you, this is a sister with a nep your nephew. But yeah, Palace of Swords. Three of Swords, one more. Temperance, Sag energy. <sighs> a lot of misused energy. If this 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 is a family influence, this is a family influence. Could be a friend, could be an ex-wife, but I'm I'm really getting that this is mostly a family influence. Um, it would really, this person would really like it if you just made the decisions they wanted you to, despite what you're, despite how you feel. That's quite terrible, right? That's quite terrible. Palace of Coins. Let's expand on the Palace of Coins, please. Seven of Coins. This person could be reminding you of a previous relationship that went up in flames pretty bad for you and is using that to influence your decisions. Okay. Ten of Wands. So, okay. And... Okay, so you are breaking free of this. You are breaking free of this. Judgment call, Queen of Wands. Okay, so you are, Queen of Wands, you are acknowledging this person as your uh, counterpart. You are acknowledging this person as your counterpart. So, breaking free of the comfortable paradigm, which doesn't look very comfortable if it's become burdensome right there with the Ten of Wands, right? So, breaking free of that paradigm, of that comfort zone, of... Breaking free of the family. I know according to the Godfather, you never go against the family. <laughs> but here it looks like this is this this is not a good thing. Okay. And you are moving toward okay, a happy cycle. Wow. Okay. Let's see what's going on with this person. They might like to write, be a poet, be an author blogger something like that there's a creative outlet here that they have that helps them kind of just cope with the ebb and flow of life okay let's see what's going on with them let's start with the three of coins please four of cups queen of wands queen of wands King of Wands, knowing damn well what it is. Seven of Cups, Prince of Wands, Princess of Pentacles. So there's a part of her that thinks that um, as much as she has wanted to acknowledge this, this connection as a divine opportunity to kind of move forward into with a soul bond, she thinks you've kind of like ducked out, okay, to be a bit more cavalier in your lifestyle, date other people, date multiple people, blah, 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 and minimize communication with her in order to do that. she That's what part of her is thinking that's happening, okay? Because she doesn't know, she doesn't know this dynamic, this person. She might know the person, but not, not, that, not the d dynamic between you. Eight of coins, let's expand on the eight of coins. The fool, the chariots, card of cancer, there you are. The Emperor, card of Aries, four of wands, sun on the bottom. She's acknowledging you as her divine counterpart. Okay. She's also trying to figure out how you could be mirroring each other right now in order to avoid that there with the four of wands. Okay. Um, she seems to be ascending in her own soul evolution there. Okay. With the Emperor, four of wands. There's something there. It's like whatever she's doing in her spiritual practice is like is going to act as a catalyst for her ascension, okay? And it, it's, it's a sure thing for her. Nine of Wands. Let's expand on the Nine of Wands, please. Two of Wands. Nine of Wands again. King of Swords. Six of Wands. She's moving forward with her life regardless of what you're doing. She's putting in a lot of work to the things that it is that she wants in life. Okay. It looks like you're holding back is only going to happen for so long. There's going to be something there that changes. It's 
going to be after that Ten of Wands. There it is. Moving forward, moving forward slowly. Okay, trying to hold back, but something along the line changes that. Okay, something along the line changes that. Wheel of Fortune, King of Wands, Justice card, Libra. Okay, giving you the incentive to balance up with this person. So she's not waiting for you. She There's some assumptions she's making. Okay, um, this is similar to the Gemini, the Cross Watcher in the Gemini's reading. Um, so if there's any Gemini in either chart kind of thing, then, you know, might want to catch those videos for um, more messages here. But it's this person is very much rooted in understanding who they are. Okay. Um, she's figuring that you're basically exploring your options. And it, she's feeling like that even though this is a soul bond, you probably do not see her as the strongest option if you're minimizing communication with her. Okay. Um, there's also a Queen of Wands out there that's thinking that um, you may not want the same things that she wants right now. You may want to be more... <coughs> Excuse me. She wants the whole enchilada. The the husband, the house, the whatever. And you may not want the kind of commitment that she's looking for right now. So she's thinking that you're going to go, you're going out to play with others. Okay. In the meantime, this person is going to finally lose control over you. Finally, 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 finally. Okay. Because there is a two of cups here. There is a soul bond here. And it is quite, it is, it is quite lovely. Okay. I'm going to head over to the extended. I'm going to see if we get to this 10 of cups. I'm going to see what's going on in this queen of wands life. I'm going to see what's going on with her in her current energy, near future, and the final outcome of the connection between you in this lifetime. So if you're interested in any of that information, along with messages from spirit about the connection at this point in time, messages between you as well as timing feel free to follow me by clicking the link in the description box below and i will see you guys over there bye mm -hmm.